Africa Talks again. Yeah, this time we are going to show you the long-awaited one four scale statue of Basic Instinct from Brisbane. Okay, I think most of the fans of uh, Basic Instinct or Sharon Stone has been waiting for a long time for the first probably an ever products collectible products this is probably the first I hope it won't be the last one um, this is a statue not action figure and um, one four scale and I have to mention that I'm using a part of the sunlight so you can see that um, on the left hand side there will be some yellow light and this is the sunshine light actually and you can see the, the shadow and I will try to do some without the sunlight so the color the skin tone is is not a problem And this is not an action figure. Uh, the whole body and the hair scrub is was done by Korean artists. Also, the painters of the floor types is also done by Korean artists. And this product, including some accessory, including the chair. I guess the chair is made made of metal the accessory including one cigarette burning cigarette a race bassinet and uh, I think it's a cigarette case so don't think that you can remove the high heels from from the statue and also including a white coat wearing in the scenery and during the movie Yes, I didn't put it on because uh, it covered all the, you know, the best property of this statue products. So, but uh, there is some instruction sheet. You can follow this to to wear the coat on the statue without any problem. So I'm going to show you how to put the secret on and how to put the raised bassinet on. Okay, it's a very easy to do. You yeah. can also put the secret case. Yes, on her hands. Not difficult. Okay, for wearing this bracelet is it's not difficult because I think made of PVC, so we can just make it open to avoid stretch the arms skin color I suggest to to widen the bracelet instead of stretching the skin color okay so I think I finished setting this statue of Sharon Stone for myself, I am very satisfied with the quality, especially the structuring of the whole body, uh, of and the hair scrub and the light layers. I think it is a ninety-five percent reconstruct the iconic scenery of Basic Instinct when she was um, investigating by the police. It totally capturing what was Sharon Stone look like in the movie and you can see the the neck structuring is really really good you know perfectly a supermodel like and very sexy and um, somebody tell me that um, the body uh, the nipples was painted but I didn't and I won't try to um, uh, remove the, the 
dress from the statue. Uh, actually, I think you can do that uh, if you want. Okay, you can see that there's a sip. You can. Uh, this is a workable sip, like a real costume. So you can uh, unzip the dress. But I I suggest not to do so because um, though the dress has certain degree of elasticity, when I install the arms uh, on the statue, because um, uh, the the arm is separated, we have to install both arms on the body. It will break the costume if you want to remove the dress. Uh, you know what I mean? Uh, in the movies, uh, this is the only dress she was wearing, so no other costume included. You can see the stand is quite really really heavy, so be careful when you uh, put the stand on the table or on your cabinet. And uh, this paper, I didn't remove it. Actually, we have to. We can remove the paper because uh, this is to avoid scratching of the floor. I think the floor is different color, but I don't try to uh, do it here. And, uh, and the whole statue can be lifted from the chair. So excuse me, I'll touch your next. Okay. So you can see, have a look at the chair. Um, the frame is made of metal, I think. And but the the leather the leather part is uh, is structure. It's made of polystone or resin. So um, but you can see it's quite heavy. And uh, altogether, this this structure or this statue is really heavy. And you can see the space is really good one. But heavy and match the feet. <laughs> okay. So um, some people complain that the, the coat is not, you know, the fabric is not too too good. But um, I don't really recall what is the material of the fabric of this coat in the movie. The fitting is good, I can say. But I don't try to do it here. And uh, if you want, you can try. And now we can see another size. Uh, the likeliness of Sharon Stone, I have no doubt. And I'm completely satisfied with the structure and also the details and the paintings of the final product. It really look good. If you, if we do the shooting like that, you can see the skin tone of the faces. That's no problem. Her is on her arm, and it look a little bit glossy. Um, but I, as I could remember in the movie, um, this is a little bit glossy, but, but may, may not be like the same way. I think the final product of this statue could be examined with video or pictures like this close distance because of the quality is really good uh, regarding the structuring of the body please judge by your own eyes Ooh. it looks really sexy I think uh, it's really worth the price and because I think the production quality is really limited and I doubt it would be reproduced for the second run, etc. Or there will be another post or different uh, similar products will be released later on. So if you are fans of Sharon Stone or, or if you think that this product is good, try to grab it before they disappear in the market.